Hi, my name is Matthew White, and um, the segment that I'm doing for anatomy physiology, my portion is acid, bases, and buffers. That's what I'm going to be talking about with you briefly. Um, first, I'll give you a definition of uh, an acid. Now, an acid is a substance when added to water, H2O, it increases the concentration of hydrogen ions. It increases the concentration of hydrogen ions, okay, in solution. Um, next, I'm going to give you the definition of a base. A base is a substance that when added to water, H2O, it increases the concentration of OH ions, okay? That's a base. Now, um, these are both really important when it comes to like solutions or even in the body. Acidity and basicity is um, they, it's measured by um, uh, a solution. Hydrogen ion concentration can be measured more or less in grams of ions per liters of solution. And the measurement they use is called the pH scale. Now the pH scale uh, is a system uh, that tracks the number of a decimal spaces in a the hydrogen ion without writing it out. So it makes it a little easier, so to speak, okay? And this is what a pH scale looks like right here. So it's numbered, one, zero to 14. Zero being a very strong acid and 14 being a very strong base, okay? Um, and they give you examples of what, what the acid and the base is. Um, gastric juice is a number two, apples number three, corn is six, um, uh, you have milk and magnesium, which is 11. Water is 7, which is neutral. It's distilled water. And um, household ammonia is like 13. So as you go further this way, that means that the solution is picking up more hydrogen ions. Further that way, that means it's uh, more OH ions, okay? Now, um, I want to talk about buffers. Now, a buffer is a solution that is able to resist change to pH. A buffer is a combination of two things, a weak acid, and a uh, conjugate salt, which and a conjugate meaning it differs by one proton, okay? A buffer is um, a combination of a weak acid and its salts in a solution that has the effect of stabilizing the pH of a solution, okay? Stabilizing the pH of a solution. Um, when it comes to buffers um, and anatomy and physiology, they're a, they're a big part of um, what keeps our body in homeostasis. With homeostasis, which is, you know, organisms process and maintaining a stable internal environment for sustaining life. Uh, buffers are more or less, um, uh, uh, it adds what's needed. So if it's too acidic, it adds OH. If it's too basic, it adds more hydrogen. It pulls more hydrogen out. Now, examples of buffers are bicarbonate buffer, phosphate buffer, and protein buffers. Okay, all can be found in our bodies to help us. Um, so that's pretty much it. You have your acids, your bases, and your buffers to keep, kind of keep us pretty much in balance. Um, my reference, my sources were Anatomy and Physiology by Sholmes and our actual textbook. Those are both our sources for acid and bases today. Thank you.